And we are back with some Zelda 2, The Adventure of Link. Game Pro and Lego Man 415 here. Yeah. Starting from the beginning. The Sleepy Princesses. And, um. <coughs> Maybe she opened up. So, yes, so now we gotta head to the Island Palace. But wait, before we do, we need to get that Ferris Bell. And yay, yeah, we can take a shortcut there. I've already shown sure up. Like the use of that mallet. Or that cave to the right. But there you go, here's an easier way. But we gotta head west first to be able to pick up something before we can make any progress. Or can really do anything. Head west to the sacred water. Oh, no well, big deal losing the sword beam. It is kind of slow and doesn't affect s some, if not many, of the enemies. Yeah, no big deal. It's faster than the first one. It's faster than any other Zelda game. Oh, I absolutely hate it when enemies Gang up on kill. Me. I was gonna say. Kill some of your experience, like some those Poe enemies. Oh yeah. They take away 20 experience, and you get 10 out of them. It sucks. Also, as you can see, my life is level six now. I recommend at least that. If there's enemies, just jump and attack. At least level six, because I've stated that the yeah, that the difficulty rises quite a bit. In that palace on the island. And now we have more health. As I was grinding, so I think that's more health. Uh, that another nitpick I have is that sometimes enemy. I mean, I've stated that sometimes enemies drop some magic and that's swollen up. But if you do need a, if you try to grind and get into feeding an enemy that would normally give you lots of experience, but give you some magic instead. Randomly. Yeah, that really sucks. It really does. It's another complaint I have about this game. But the sake of water has been retrieved, and now we're heading back to the east, to the town we have visited before. Got the down thrust, oh. which really does help with some of the enemies. That looks more like potion than sake of water. Even if you, even if they are unaffected on enemies, you can still. Get on the other side of them without taking damage. Hey, hey. I thought you had to get the sacred water from a cat. But um Dragon Ball reference? Yeah. That is lame. Okay, so please let me help you come inside. Dialogue not necessary. That was quick. So, take your water, then we get that fairy spell, wherever, come up at a convenient time, was here where I got the down thrust, it probably uh, is, I think so, let us see, let us see, yep, not necessary. Later we'll get the upward thrust, which is definitely not as useful, but can so, definitely help so with some of the airborne enemies, many of which are annoying as all hell. Stop and restore you. Okay, it's nice and all, but that's not what I'm trying to accomplish here. Already found the location, the place. And we gotta go to the graveyard after this. Hey, sorry, come to my cave. Little smeg, the one who gives you power. Because fairy, fairy. equals power. Mm, get your 
<laughs> yes. Well, fairy spell. Well, he didn't just completely miss spell. a gap for what I assume is a life spell, which we couldn't get. So, another slight nitpick. Whatever. I'm Any hoosies. I'm sorry for all those offended by that. But you know what? He just gave him a fairy spell. He so he deserves it. Get out of here. Mm, I'm gonna suck on your soul. Okay. Alright, there we go. What's this lady today? This is Kingston. Bring up. Need to find some hidden area. It's just pop up from nowhere and you'll end up dying or losing experience. Over. Or both. Of course, I mean, you can't die. But you can't lose experience. Um, um, because you. As you're losing experience, obviously, you're losing life, so. Yeah, it's redundant. So, where is it? There it is. Found it! Not gonna lie, even though I've practiced and made through the island palace, I'm, I'm not completely confident. Confident. <laughs> Sheesh. Okay. I fail at speech sometimes. Always had that issue. It's okay. Everyone does at some point. Not to the same extent as moi. Yeah, that's how that fair spell is required. I'll not be using it unless I absolutely have to. Whoa. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. And I upgrade. Even though I oh. could have upgraded the magic to level 5 for me, upgrade to level 6. Yeah. While I could have done that. Magic is definitely the least exciting to upgrade out of everything. I ended up, I ended up not needing as much magic as I do, since now shield. You can already use six times before you have to restore and use some more type of magic. And the jump spell I don't use unless I have to either. Hold on a bit. Wow, this pattern is like really confusing here. Alrighty. Like, yeah. It, it all so, kind of looks like. So, it all like to write. So here we are in this maroon palace. What a maroon. Hey, Link, where'd Link go, guys? Where did he go? He disappeared. Farm G, L, and G. Well, on the bright side, the enemies aren't easy to tell. Another 100, so. It's a cell phone! They can use a downward thrust too. Though. It's even uglier than the average cell phone. It's wolf phone. You cannot stab those spike enemies without no, having no. a. Don't thrust one of those blocks. I should really start using shield more often since, since I've stated that yeah. I I tend to have magic left over before I die, so I may as well. Go with this. So it, I guess it would be rational to just use it. Let's get that key. Quickly now before I get hit. Okay, I didn't I didn't take damage there. I'll worry about it once I can. Very good. As I said, the enemies become much tougher here. And these guys again, but these aren't even the worst kind of enemies. Actually, that would be like those club guys. 
but the, guys the worst accent, yeah. is that there are blue versions of Dark Nuts. Of course, they take more hits, but not only that, they they kind of have their own sword beam attack. Well, they throw, where should, it's probably that they throw knives at you. Oh yeah, I remember that. Actually, I can level up if I defeat this bozo. Okay, I lied. Quit lying to your audience. It's not nice. Yeah. Oh, how are you outside? What the heck? Why is that guy, uh, yellow? So, yeah, so hopefully you are these levels as you're going through, because as I, as I can't stress enough, this one is a toughie. Okay. Not a bright idea. Any who's? Let's go down a level. Are you going to try and maximize everything before you hit the final boss? Yes, I will. I will do that. Although, when I first legitimately beat the game, my magic... Um, my life was at level 8, but I actually finished it with magic and sword at level 7, so I... So I didn't have to max out. Last time I played through this, and I'm pretty proud of it. Wow. But, I mean, damn, they... For like the level 7 and 8 stuff, they really require a ton of experience. It's even as you go through the toughest dungeons, and hopefully not as you're not dying, you still take a long time. If you find some pee bags, like in the place they are supposed to be, be sure to level up if you're gonna grab them. If not, don't save, especially for like the 500 ones. Stop throwing knives. These guys are a huge pain. Do a lot of damage given with the shield. Yippers. Um, Dang it. Well, I'm gonna have to retry this, but at least I'll start with level 5 magic. As I stated, Jump technique I've saved with the red versions. It it works for these guys too. But once you attack them, they start rapidly throwing knives. Just they have unlimited, I guess. I, I still know the pattern for being able to stab them without them blocking it. It's like when they get a few pixels closer to you or like when you can just barely reach them that seems to be when you're able to do damage to them but I'm not 100% sure do not quote me on that you picked up a raft by the way yep, now we can head east some more more exploring afterwards move love, bye bye I was waiting for it and went to commit suicide because the way I was taking that chance. There's a lava in there and all. Come on, shield now. Okay, these guys take more experience too. F them. They don't even give out that much experience. I hate those enemies. They suck. Still, still not as bad as like likes, though. Yeah, I'd rather have my own just taken on. Or bubbles. Okay, bubbles suck. Da -da 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 -da. I also actually like the music in this game even more so than the first game. Same here. Although I kinda like the no, I, I like this music better. <laughs> I was gonna say, I, I, I kinda like the dungeon theme in the first Zelda a lot. 
But really, my favorite from the first Zelda is probably the overworld theme. Yeppers. Trying to get away out of this. This isn't working. It's a trap! Is there an unlimited amount of enemies. I won't need the jump spell, and I will not. Assume this will. If yeah, this one isn't as lengthy as the last one, but due to the enemies, it is a far bigger challenge still. These things just won't die. They just keep coming back to life. Definitely won't be leveling up until the very end. I'm not. No. I'm not. Alright. I don't want to waste a jump spell. Oh, yeah. I don't have that much magic left. I'll be extremely lucky to survive this upcoming boss. It is basically one of those, except it's on a steed. for those who don't know what a steed is. Okay, at least I got that blue one off screen. Jeez. And that one is... Yeah, this one is even more rapid with the uh, knife throwing. So many knives it has. But here we are. It didn't take long. This like first going. phase isn't too difficult. Just need to down thrust at the right time. Even if you don't miss the even if you don't get the vital point, you're still not gonna take damage. As long as you're down thrusting an enemy, even if it doesn't harm them, it won't harm you either, so there you go. This knight can kick kick can like go for spells. Jump, hit, jump, hit. Did you see the pattern? Boom, ba, boom, ba, goopa dee, doo. I just got my butt handed to me. Anyway. That would have rhymed if I went with oompa loompa doopity dee. Dang it. Oh well. 